welcome back. Joining me now is the First Lady of Wyoming, Jenny Gordon. Jenny, thank you so much for being here. I'm, I'm for being here. I'm so excited to talk to you because. The Wyoming Hunger Initiative is a project you're really passionate about, and, and I love what this program is about. So first, tell us what, what all this initiative stands for. Sure. Well, the Hunger Initiative does not reinvent the wheel. We work in all 23 counties to fight food insecurity, whether it's children, families, seniors, or veterans. And so we don't reinvent the wheel. We just support those agencies on the ground. And tell me, you know, where is where are your donations, where are your supplies coming from, and, and how are you getting this food and distributing it? Sure. So we have so many producers, ag producers, that have donated to our Beef for Backpack programs, which I would love to share a little more with you about. We also have hunters who donate their harvest through our Food from the Field program, and we have gardeners who are producing um, beautiful gardens and donating some of that as well. Well, tell me, tell me about what is beef for backpacks. Well, sure. Um, I, I brought a sample. <laughs> um, this is a program that we have started. We piloted it in Laramie County last year. They are a beef that is produced right here in the state. It is processed here in the state, so it's a Wyoming solution to hunger. These go in backpacks throughout the state. We did um, 1,100 a week last year in Laramie County, and we want to do the whole state this year. We have our little map all ready to go, and um, so most of our counties are already done, but we have a few counties left, and what we're going to do is um, just ask donors um, if they could just do a call cow, we'll get it processed and we'll get those in kids' backpacks. Another, um, you know, fundraising component of this is the scarf, which is really beautiful. So tell us about the scarf and, and who designed it. Absolutely. So this is our Cowboy Stomp and Hunger Scarf. This is our second scarf. It was designed by Lexi at um, Alexis Drake in Cheyenne, Wyoming. And it, we had it down at Frontier Days. You can see we've partnered with Frontier Days for the last uh, three years. And this helps all the proceeds go to fight hunger in Wyoming. Well, tell me, uh, you know, if you if you could give everybody a challenge in, in helping out, you know, helping their neighbor, helping feed, the, you know, what would that challenge be and what would you encourage people to do? Sure. Well, number one, give where you live. So if you're in a community that um, has a food pantry or a Boys and Girls Club, donate to them if you can. Volunteer with your time, but also tell the story because I think everyone is one emergency away from being in need. So if we work hard to help others, we can really raise our whole community up. Well, I think another really um, important thing that's behind this program is you really champion ag producers as well. Um, you know, why is supporting the agriculture industry also important to you? Sure. Well, I am a producer as well. I came a little late to the game. I was about 37. Um, but I think as producers, we always care about our neighbors. If someone's broke down in the field, we'll take our tractor over in our baler and we'll help our neighbor without being asked. And that is, the I think, the soul of Wyoming. And and uh, the soul of ag in general. So I'm just proud to be a part of it. Well, tell me, where do we need to go to get more information and support the Hunger Initiative? Sure. So our website is nohungerwyo.org, uh, and you can get on there. You can look where you can donate, look where you can volunteer, but also if you're in need of assistance, you can find an agency in your area, and you can access help that way. Thank you so much for being here. This is so awesome, and we love, love to see the work that you're doing. Appreciate you being here. Don't go anywhere. We have more Superior Sunrise up next.